대학교에 다니고 여기 오게 된 계기가 월댄스 국제학교에 다니는데 경배와 찬양을 같이 도와주지 않겠냐 이렇게 물어 몇쪽 물어보셔가지고요 같이 동참한 The reason I'm here, first of all, is because I'm a student at Walden High School, and um, a group of a group of us um, who is involved in music were asked to come here to um, share our music with you. 이번에 방학이 길어서 놀줄 알았는데 놀지 못하고 계속 바쁘게 돌아다니면서 일했어요. Um, and actually, we had a long vacation, long summer break um, this year, so I was expecting to have a great time enjoying my vacation, but then I ended up getting involved in this, so I had to work a lot throughout the summer. 어 그랬는데 제가 이 집회 와고 처음에는 전혀 이런 개념을 가지고 오지 않았어요. 좀 살짝 어, 극극극 보수파다라는 오해도 이렇게 가지고 있었고 그런 얘기를 들어서. So actually, when I first heard about this conference, I didn't really have any um, idea of what this is, what this was about, and I actually heard some stories about how this conference is um, composed of people who are very, very um, conservative. 어 그랬는데 이 집회 와서 결론부터 말씀드리자면. 후회를 하나도 하지 않고요. 저는 저 가족들이 다 같이 왔으면 좋겠는데 저 혼자 그냥 너무나 아쉽습니다. Let me just um, tell you the conclusion first. Um, I do not regret a single moment that I participated in this conference. I'm so happy that I was here, and now I regret that I didn't bring my whole family here. I wish everybody was here to share the blessings with me. 특별히 제가 가장 감명 깊었던 이야기들이 몇 가지 있는데요. 첫 번째로는 어, 세바스찬의 설교를 통해서 들었던 우리의 가장 큰 우상이 하나님의 사역이 될수 있다라는 거였어요. So there were several things that really impressed my heart, but one of the things, the first thing was um, Sebastian's message about how um, doing Christ's mission can be our biggest idol that blocks away. Um, blocks us away from Jesus. 학기 중에도 그리고 방학 때도 저는 그러니까 여러 가지 기회가 많았어요. 또 리더를 해야 된다, 무슨 일을 맡아서 어디를 갔다 오고 그런 식으로 일을 하면서 꽤 보람은 있었지만 저의 마음에는 힘듦이 더 컸고 어, 그 중에서 하나님의 사역을 한다면서 하나님을 많이 만나지 못했어요. So I had, I actually have a lot of opportunities at school um, to be act as a leader and participate in many different activities that are spiritual. Um, but and whenever I do those things, I feel very um, rewarded in some sense. But a lot of times, I felt like I wasn't really meeting God. 어 그랬는데 딱그 금요일 날그 말씀을 하시자마자 저건 내 얘기다. 내가 다시 돌아와야겠구나. 하나님의 사역을 하나님의 이름 없이 하는 건 쓸모가 없구나라는 생각이 들었어요. But on Friday night when I listened to when I heard the message from Sebastian from God, I was convicted and I knew that he was speaking to my heart and um, it reminded me to come back to God um, and doing God's mission without God in the center is it becomes useless. 어, 두 번째로는 안식일 날 노방 전도를 나갔을 때인데요. And then the second lesson that I learned to happen um, on Sabbath afternoon when we went out to outreach. 저 사실은 피곤해서 가기 싫었지만 어떻게 어떻게 해서 가게 됐는데요. 저는 어, 별로 성공하지 못했어요 그 전도를 통해서. And I was actually really tired and I really didn't want to go out, but I ended up going out. And I was actually unsuccessful. 어 저희가 처음에 저랑 또 다른 학교에 있는 오빠랑 앱슨과 셋이서 경찰서에 들어가게 됐는데 어느새 보니까 저희 팀들은 다른 팀들은 뭐 청년이 여기 갔다 그러더라고요. And um, me and another um, guy and then Epson, three of us ended up being at a police station. And then we looked around and found out that the rest of the group members were in Cheongyangli Station. 저희가 나가기 전에 어그심 회장님에게도 그렇고 어 여러 가지 이렇게 전도를 어떻게 할 것인가에 대해서 교육을 좀 받았어요. 
before we went out, um, we were actually, we received some lessons or we were got training um, about how we should do the outreach. 저희 학교에서 가끔씩 전도지 돌리는 그런 일들을 많이 해봤어요. 그래서 저는 별로 어, 이 전도에 대해서 그렇게 준비를 하지 않고 갔던 것 같아요. 쉽게 생각했던 것 같아요. And actually at our school we have a lot of activities, similar activities of like giving out tracts and um, um, things like that to um, people, outreaching people like that. So I thought that it was going to be something similar and I just and before this, I've never actually done an outreach where I would approach a person who looks like a, the person really needs to meet God and have a conversation with that person and share my personal stories. And then I listened to other people's stories um, from my friends who went to Cheongyangli Station and other places. Some of them actually got had an opportunity to talk to other people and even pray with those people. 어, 저는 계속 계속 거절을 당했었고 일단 제 마음 자체가 좀 준비가 되지 않아서인지 어떻게 일을 해야 될지 모르겠고 용기가 계속 떨어지기 시작했어요. And for me, I was rejected several times, and I was actually not prepared to have those conversations. So I was getting really discouraged. 그래도 제가 실패를 계속했지만 결국 저와 대화를 하기를 원하는 분들은 많이 안 계셨지만 그래도 저는 감사했던 이유가 하나 있었어요. And although I was unsuccessful, unsuccessful in having long conversations with people, people didn't really want to talk to me. Um, but I was still grateful for, for something. 그 순간에 계속 낙심하지 않고 어, 하나님께 기도를 하도록 저에게 성령님이 되게 기도해라 너 힘들지 하고 용기를 주셨던 것 같아요. Uh, even in those um, disappointing moments, I felt like the Holy Spirit was speaking to me, trying to encourage me and tell me, I know how you feel. 그래서 저는 어, 끝까지 그래도 하나님 도와주세요. 제가 어떻게 해야 될지 알려주세요. 라고 기도를 하고 돌아갔던 거에 대해서 이렇게 실패는 좀 후회는 없었습니다. So even though I was unsuccessful in some terms, um, I did not regret the experience because I was able to pray continuously and communicate with God throughout the experience. 어, 그리고 이렇게 세세하게 다 얘기할 수는 없지만 전반적으로 제가 결심을 하게 된 거는요. And even though I have the time, I don't have the time to explain all the details. Um, but there's something that I want to share, a decision that I made. 어, 저 어린 나이 이런 얘기를 하기 좀 그렇지만 살아갈 어, 목적과 뭔가 삶의 동기가 생겨서 정말 감사합니다. Um, I'm still, I might be still too young to say this um, in front of all of you, but I feel like I found the purpose of life, and I'm thankful that there is a motivation in my life now. 내가 왜 열심히 살아야 하는지, 내가 왜 어, 이렇게 리더가 되고 아니면 부원이 돼서 열심히 일을 수행해 나가야 되는지, 왜 하나님을 믿어야 되는지, 교회에서 어떤 역할을 해야 될지. 내 겉모습이나 행동보다는 제 마음에서부터 시작해야 된다는 걸 느끼게 So why I need to be motivated to act as a leader and a member in a group? Why I need to strive hard to achieve something? Why I need to believe in God? Um, and um, I learned that I need all of this has to come from my heart, not just by the acts and the outward appearance, but it needs to come from my heart.
was designated to share. 제가 지정을 받았습니다. <웃음> And I'm back to <웃음> 그리고 저는 통역과 함께 통자 같이 이렇게 얘기하는 게 익숙하지 않으니까 이해해주세요. So, um, mostly what I, I guess what I was thinking was um, uh, Sabbath afternoon, I, I went out on outreach um, mostly because Handel wanted me to take pictures. <웃음> 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 노방전도로 나간 이유가 핸들이 저한테 사진 찍어달라고 하지 않습니다. So I, um, I didn't really, I didn't really prepare. You know, most of the time, like okay, outreach, I should pray and prepare my heart for it. 어, 보통은 제가 나, 나가서 전도를 한다 이러면 기도하고 준비를 할 텐데 사실 그날은 별로 준비가 안돼 있었어요. But I just went to take pictures. 그냥, 그냥 사진 찍으러 간 거였거든요. But anyway, so I went out and um, we went, I don't even know the area. I just know it's, um, it's walking distance from here. Um, I don't know. Okay. So, anyway, so, um, anyway, so we went out and we had the, we had the glow tracks. I, I didn't even write the letter because before, during the meeting, I was doing told me. So I went out and I had a few blood tracks and I went with a young man named Trevor. 그리고 이제 저희가 그냥 전도지 그 조그만 그 트랙 그 전도지를 가지고 트래블이라는 아, 청년이랑 같이 돌아다녔습니다. So we were walking around and it was really hot and so we were looking for people but there weren't a lot of people outside. 음, 정말 날씨가 더웠기 때문에 나가신 분들은 아시겠지만 밖에 사람들이 별로 없었어요. So we were, you know, handing out the tracks. We, um, we had we had gone down and the the tissue we were supposed to hand out hadn't arrived yet, so we were just handing out those tracks. 약간 그 설명을 드리자면 결례교회에서 저희가 티슈를 가져와야 했는데 그게 아직 도착하기 전이어서 처음에는 그냥 전도지만 나눠주고 있었습니다. So um, mostly Trevor was doing most of it. I I I don't know very much Korean at all. 저는 한국말 잘 못하기 때문에 Trevor이라는 그 외국 분이 거의 대부분의 나눠주는 일을 하고 있었어요. So I was then I would try to say you know this is a hello this is a gift. 근데 한국말로 제가 짧은 한국말로 아 안녕하세요 이거 당신이 만 선물입니다 이렇게 얘기했어요. So anyway, um, after a while the tissues came, so we went back to find the rest of our group. 어 그리고 이제 좀 기다리니까 그 티슈 물 티슈가 와가지고 다른 그룹 멤버들을 찾으러 갔습니다. So we got some tissue and and we decided that it wasn't best to for everyone to be together because it's kind of intimidating to walk out five people together. 한 다섯 명 정도가 갑자기 이렇게 한 사람한테 다가가면 무서우니까 저희가 이제 좀 서로 나눠주지 않겠습니다. So by this time I was thinking, okay, I'm here to do outreach. I, I in the U.S. I used to canvas. 어 근데 이제 그때 딱 생각이 든게 제가 미국에 있을 때 문서 전도를 되게 많이 했었거든요. So handing out stuff is really super easy in comparison. 어, 이렇게 집집마다 가면서 문서 전도 하는 거에 비하면 그냥 이렇게 전도지 길에서 나눠주는 거는 너무 쉬운 일입니다. So I was like, oh, this is fun. I, I, this is, this is the kind of stuff I know how to do. 어, 진짜 재밌고 나 내가 잘하는 일이다 이런 생각이 들었어요. So I headed off and I was like, okay, I had all these stack of tissues in my hand and the glow tracks and it's like, oh, okay. So I started going around and handing out to everyone I see. So I and then I'm thinking, oh yeah, I'm supposed to be taking pictures of people. So I was like, oh, I'm supposed to be taking pictures of people. But by this time, we only had a couple minutes, so I was like, well, I'm going to have fun and just hand out some. <laughs> 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 so, I was like, well, I'm going to have fun and just hand out some. 
So basically, that was my Sabbath afternoon experience. I I, I really enjoyed it. I um, even though I probably didn't go out with the right mindset and the the right attitude, I really enjoyed it. 그래서 제가 처음에는 준비되지 않은 상태에서 어, 아마도 준비되지 않은 태도 그런 태도를 가지고 나갔지만 그래도 제가 결국에는 정말 너무 좋은 시간을 보냈고 어, 전도하게 돼서 But there was a limit to the number of people who could come, and um, it was actually the group of people who could do participate in music who were invited, and I couldn't really, I can't really play any instruments, so I thought that I wouldn't have an opportunity. Oh, actually, I do play violin, um, but I'm not really good at it. And there were other player, um, people who were going to participate by um, playing the instruments, but they couldn't come um, at the end. So there were spaces for me, and I was able to come. So I'm, I'm really thankful to God that he provided a way for me to come and participate. The first reason why I really wanted to come is because I heard many good um, stories about this conference, how um, it's very um, consecrated and devoted um, group of people who are really trying to see God. And I've been to many other um, similar conferences, but um, I thought this one would be somewhat different. 그래서 어, 아니나 다를까 어머니가 정말 어, 앞에도 얘기했지만 세바스찬의 그런 강의가 너무 감명 어, 있었고 정말 좋은 시간들을 얻고 그리고 좋은 말씀을 들을 수 있었습니다. And as I expected, I was not disappointed um, by um, all the good messages that Sebastian um, delivered to us of the word from God, and I was really blessed from the whole conference. 그리고 어, 잘 하지는 못하지만 이렇게 봉사로 와서 어, 음악으로 또 하나님께 어, 하나님께서 주신 달란트를 이렇게 사용할 수 있는 기회를 가질 수 있게 되어서 정말 좋은 시간이었습니다. And even though I'm not really really good at playing violin, I'm really thankful um, that I was able to serve the Lord with the talents that He has given. 다음에 또 기회가 된다면 다시 한번 오고 싶습니다. 아멘. And if there's another opportunity later in the future, I would like to come again. Thank you. 다소는 학회 어 연합회에서 오조 나와 주세요. 오조 대리교회 거기 가면. Yeah. 
안녕하세요. 저는 지금 각 대학교를 들어 신입생 배석주입니다. Hi, my name is Hak Ju Lee, and I'm a freshman in college. 제가 삼역 학교를 안 나왔어요. 그래서 제 친구 중에 신앙하는 친구가 한 명도 없어요. 그래. <laughs> I, I didn't graduate from um, Adventist school, uh, high school, so around me, all of my friends are not Adventists or not Christians. So, I was a little bit of a friend, and I was a little bit of a friend, and I was a little bit of a friend. And I always felt kind of lonely in my journey of faith, um, but I was really encouraged um, by all of these people who share the same faith. 그리고 그 첫째 날에 세바스찬 브렉스턴 목사님 말씀하신 듯이 저희가 100% 그리스도인이 되어야 한다고 하셨잖아요. And um, I remember from the first message that Sebastian gave us, um, we need to be 100% Christian. 제가 항상 고등학교 때부터 느꼈는데 저도 예수님 예수님이 아, 하늘 아버지가 완벽하신 것 같이 너희도 완벽하라라고 하셨잖아요. And since I was in high school, um, I was always encouraged by the word um, where Jesus says, "As the God in heaven is perfect, you must also be perfect." 근데 재림 교회에서 약간 그 완벽하, 완벽주의라고 좀 매도하는 경향이 있는 것 같아요. 완벽주의자라고 어떤 목사님을 완벽주의자라고 매도하는 목사인 것 같고 예수님 안에서 우리가 완벽해진다는 걸 완벽해질 수 있다는 걸 믿지 않는 사람들 많이 봤는데 렉스턴 목사님 우리 100%가 되어야 된다고 했고 또 어떤 다른 분이 개인적으로 목사님한테 질문을 했을 때 예수님, 예수님과 같이 완벽한 사람을 봤냐고 질문했을 때 브렉스턴 목사님, 아 목사님이 아니시죠? 브렉스턴 분이 브렉스턴, 미스터 브렉스턴이 그런 사람을 봤다, 자기는 그런 사람을 봤고 우리는 우리가 거기에 도달해야 한다고 확신 있게 말하는 것에서 정말 감사했습니다, 하나님께 And since High school, I always um, learned, thought that we should be perfect as Christians, but then I was kind of disappointed by people, some Adventists, who don't seem to believe in um, perfectionism and even like point at fingers um, that others or other Adventists or pastors who are striving to be to become perfect like God. Um, we sometimes say um, those people are legalists, um, but then when Sebastian said um, that he has actually met someone. Who is as perfect as Jesus? Um, that really encouraged me, and um, I was glad to hear that. 그리 제가 그리고 의과 대학에 진학했는데요. 제가 의료 선교사를 하고 싶어서 진학했습니다. And I'm currently studying medicine to become a doctor and um, become a medical missionary. 근데 이번 전도 활동이라고 하긴 뭐 선교 활동이라고 뭐. 하기는 좀 뭐하지만 그래도 전그 전도지 분교를 하면서 약간 맛을 봤잖아요 저희가. <웃음> Although it's, it, it may be a little difficult to call the outreach and mission work um, that we did on Sabbath, it was somewhat of a taste of what mission work is. 하면서 제가 얼마나 할수 있는 게 없는지 느꼈고요. 그러니까 거절 당할 때나. 네, 그 거절 당할 때참 그걸 많이 느꼈던 것 같아요. 근데 그러면서 계속 예수님께 기도하게 되더라고요. 평소에는 그러지 않았는데 계속 예수님께 기도하고 예수님과 계속 연결될 수밖에 없더라고요. 네. And while, as I was getting, keep getting rejected, I felt really helpless, but that made me really pray hard to God and um, seek to get connected to Jesus. And that was something that I couldn't experience before. 선교사로 사는 게 몸은 힘들지라도 예수님과 항상 연결될 수 있는 가장 좋은 직업인 것 같다고 느꼈고 네, 앞으로도 그 길을 갈수 있도록 계속, 계속 기도할 생각입니다. 네. So I was convicted that I 
was convinced that um, becoming a missionary is the best way to be connected to Jesus mm -hmm. um, because I have to continuously surrender to him and depend on him. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So first of all, um, near my school, the closest church that is there. When did you come to Korea? <laughs> <laughs> I came to Korea in Ichon. I came to Korea in 2013, but that has nothing to do with what I'm going to say. <laughs> okay. uh, so the closest church to where I live is Hagwon uh, Kyohe. It's a language institute church. And for some of you who don't understand how they work, the language institute churches are, are established so that as Koreans go to learn English, like they can also be, um, introduced. Yeah, they can be introduced to Christianity. So it's part of the mission work. 제가 지금 살고 있는 곳 되게 가까운 곳에 가장 가까운 저희 그림 교회가 학원 교회인데 어 거의 대부분 아시겠지만 학원 교회는 영어를 가르쳐 주는 것뿐 아니라 실제로는 선교를 하기 위해서 세워진 교회들이죠. So it's it's a good church to be in, but like the problem that I had was that because you have a lot of new Christians, then the sermons are still, you know, basics. So just like Paul says that when you are young, you you fed on milk, but as you grow older, you need to eat meat. So, 좋은 미션 필드고 선교할 수 있는 그런 곳이긴 하지만 어 굉장히 많은 사람들이 아직 어 기도 이제 막 신앙을 시작한 그런 어 그리스도인들이 많기 때문에. 어, 바울이 말씀하신 대로 어, 그분들은 아직 우유를 마셔야 돼 아직 고기를 못 먹고 우유를 마시는 그런 단계인 사람들이 많습니다. But for me, I've been a Christian for like six to seven years, and so I feel like I need to eat meat. I need stronger stomachs. Like you know, I need to study about like the mark of the beast. <laughs> <laughs> Those kind of ad, no, the, well, Adventist things that we are supposed to spread, you know, things like um, what, the, the Christ and his being a priestly ministry, those kind of things, right? <laughs> 어, 우유가 아닌 밥을 먹을 때가 된것 같은데 예를 들면 다 알아두셨죠? 짐승의 표, 뭐또 뭐 예수님의 그 대제사장으로서의 역할이라든지 뭐 성령의 그 늦은 비 성령 이런 것들에 대해서 공부를 하고 싶은 그런 마음이 있었습니다. And so I got tired. I felt like my faith is. I feel like I'm not growing. Like I need these things, but I can't get them in this church. So I was thinking that maybe I should. For a new church. And then, but then you see, like, I am a foreigner, so I need to go somewhere where people around me will be comfortable with me being there. And I, because it's difficult, honestly speaking, to just go to a Completely Korean church, like every day you feel like a foreigner. So, and when you go to church, you want to feel like home. But then I can't find a church close to me where I can simply just fit in and 
like have all these things. So I was very frustrated because of that. 그리고 제가 외국인이기 때문에 사실 한국말 굉장히 잘하는 외국인이지만 어, 어디를 가도 그냥 일반 한인 교회를 가면은 제가 그냥 거기에 자연스럽게 어, 섞여서 그렇게 지내기가 사실은 어려워요. 그래서 어, 제가 스스로 정말 집에 온 것처럼 편안하게 예배를 드릴 수 있는 그런 교회를 찾아야 되는데 그런 곳이 집 근처에는 없어서 정말 어, 너무 힘든 그런 마음적으로 신적으로 힘든 시간을 보내고 있었어요. Sebastian Braxton, he was like, some of, he said, some people keep saying that they don't want to go to church because they feel like the someone is not inspiring. <laughs> and uh, you know, when you do that, you're blaming the church. Like, when you go to church, you always go, you shouldn't go thinking that I should get blessed. You should go there knowing that I am going to be a blessing. Mm -hmm. So that because we are going to worship and we are going to worship God and that when the Israelites went to worship, they went with something to give to God. They did not go to receive anything. 저희는 교회에 가는 이유는 하나님을 경배하기 위해서 가는 것인데 이스라엘 사람들도 하나님을 경배할 때는 하나님께 영광을 돌리기 위해서 간 것이지 그들이 뭔가 얻으려고 간 것이 아니었습니다. And then that um, so I realized that Sebastian so, Rockson was saying that we usually blame people for our own uh, lack, like something that we're <laughs> 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 like always like short sure, comment. Like I'm the shortcomings, like I am the one who is doing something wrong, but I'm blaming other people. So I realized, like yesterday night, when I was thinking about it, that the reason why I feel like I'm not inspired is because during the week, I work, I'm so busy, I don't have time to actually have deep devotions. And so like at the end of the week, I feel like, oh, I really need something. And then I go expect the pastor to give me everything, instead of me doing it myself. So I am the one who has not been doing my part, and yeah. That's it. 그 사실 저희가 많은 경우에 내가 뭔가 잘못하고 있으면서 다른 사람의 잘못을 지적할 때가 많은데 저도 생각을 해보니까 제가 한 주를 살 때는 너무 바쁘게 살고 말씀도 the second one, just very short. Um, this conference, like the theme One in Christ, I was part of organizing the conference. I didn't do much, I just did a little bit, but I was part of the organizing team. But when we were doing this, honestly, I felt like we were one in Christ. 제가 사실 뭐 큰일을 한건 아니지만 이거 준비하는데 준비위원회 도와드렸는데 제가 준비를 할때 제가 정말 그리스도 안에서 하나가 되는 것을 느꼈습니다. Okay. Like when we were doing everything, there was no, like Jehovah, he, when he gathered everyone, like he did not, for me I was surprised, it was because he did not draw any lines like, oh these are foreigners and these are Koreans, like we all worked together and he gave everyone work, you know, I didn't expect him to give me any work, so I was just like, I'm going to relax and just, but then he kept giving me work, he's like, you're going to do this and this and this, I was like, really? He's like, and he was giving, whether you're a foreigner or a Korean or anything, he didn't think that, oh, only Koreans can do this, it's like, he made me like, chief of the registration team, <laughs> and small group leaders, yeah, small group leaders, he didn't care, he was like, <laughs> <laughs> <웃음> 그 준비를 하는데 저희가 이제 모였는데 어이그 회장이신 그 심지어 회장님이 저는 사실 생각하기를 한국 사람이랑 외국인이랑 이렇게 구분을 해서 이건 한국 사람만 할수 있는 일이야 이거는 외국 사람이 하는 일이야 이렇게 구분할 줄 알았는데 그러지 않고 외국인이 저한테 막 너무 많이 일을 시키고 저한테 사실 아무것도 안 시킬 줄 알았어요 그래서 나는 그냥 그걸 안, 아무것도 안 해야지 이러고 있었는데. 저한테 막 레지스트레이션도 하라고 그러고 스모글 리더의 리더도 하라고 그러고 그래서 사실 좋았습니다. <웃음> <웃음>
정말 희망을 뜨겁게 시작했습니다. So I started off um, with a lot of passion. 아, 주님 덕분에 저는 교사가 될수 있었고. And uh, by God's grace, I became a teacher. 그리고 저는 점점 세속적으로 됐습니다. And then I started to become more secular. 제가 교사가 될때한 이유가 <웃음> 이겁니다. 저는 그 시험 결과를 확인하기 직전에 어, 제가 대학교 때 배운 가장 중요한 것은 얻은 가장 중요한 것은 교사가 되는 것이 아니라 하나님을 만나는 것입니다. Uh, and uh, before I graduated from college, I prayed, but um, the one thing that I gained from my college experiences. Not becoming a teacher, but the, the fact that I met God. 시험 결과를 확인하기 전에 저는 교사가 되지 않아서 좋다고 생각했습니다. Um, and this was the prayer that I prayed right before I checked my um, test results to become a teacher. And I said, um, God, I don't care if I don't become a teacher. 어 그렇게 뜨거웠는데 점점 직장 생활하다 보니까 점점 제가 식어갔습니다. That's how passionate I was back then. But then when I started working, I lost that passion. 그리고 제 가정의 문제가 점점 저에게 크게 나왔습니다. And the problems that I have in my family became um, bigger to me. 이제 집이 지옥 같습니다. I felt like hell to be in my house. 어 그래도 점점 나아졌습니다. 하나님 저를 사랑하시기 때문에 점점 나아지겠습니다. But God still loves me, so um, it it improved. The situation s improved. 어전 여기 와서 제가 정말 많은 사랑을 받고 있다고 생각하게 되었습니다. And one thing that I learned from um, being here is the fact that I'm really loved. 좀 이야기가 좀 모였겠는데, <웃음> 어 저는 어 저희 가정 가정의 제일 작은 사람들이 있습니다. 가장 작은 그러니까 가장 작은 자에게 한 것이 나에게 받고 갔다고 하신 예수님이 말씀하신 것 같아서 가장 작은 사람이었습니다. My family is a very um, small, in my view, um, it's the smallest of the smallest. Um, because um, we don't, our family is, doesn't believe in God. 어 처음 저기 오기 전에는 사실 그거에 대해서 불만이라고 느꼈고 저주라고 느꼈는데 전 여기 오고 나서 그것이 제가 해야 할 일이라고 생각했습니다. And before I came here, I was complaining about that fact. Um, that my family doesn't believe in God, and I thought it was a curse for me. But after attending this conference, um, I'm convinced that it's the work that I need to work on. So, the most small person does the work that I do, and the work that I do is the work that I do. And as Jesus said, um, what you do to the least of the least um, is what you do for me. Um, for me, my family is like that. Um, it's the least but of the people, in my view, but what I do to my family members is what I would do to Jesus. So I felt really blessed. Martin Kim, the Anshik Rakyo, Martin Kim, is a very small person. Um, during Sabbath school, um, Martin Kim, the speaker, shared about the story about how um, a person sh shares blessings with the least. 저 사람은 남에게도 저렇게 할수 있는데 저는 가족에게 저렇게 할까 그렇게 생각했습니다. And the person from the story was able to sh um, share things with um, a stranger, a person that the person is not related to, and it hit me that I was. Restraining to share these blessings with my own family members. 어 점점 어떻게 그래서 다른 많은 얘기들이 있었지만은 시간이 좀 짧으니까 어 점점 그래서 점점 이렇게 생각하게 됐습니다. 아 하나님이 역시 역시는 아니지만 하나님이 정말 나를 사랑하시구나. 처음 이렇게 생각해요. 하나님이 왜냐면은 제가 질투에서 시작하기 때문에 하나님이 저 사람들보다 나를 훨씬 사랑하시고. 왜냐면은 저는 제가 25년 동안 시간이 없어서 제가 분들 많아서 제가 문제된 것이 많고 또 저는 제게 주어진 일이 많기 때문에. So although I started off with jealousy and envy, um, I learned that God loves me more than anyone else. Um, God loves me greatly um, by allowing me to go through this experience because He knows that. I've lived a simple life for 25 years, and because I'm a recent Christian, 
um, I, I have more work to do. So God is allowing me to um, have this kind of experience. Uh, 하나님이 저 사람보다 저 사람들보다 이 사람들보다 나를 훨씬 사랑한다고 생각한 그 순간 제 질투의 마음이 없어지고 사람들이 다르게 생각했습니다. 아 so, 하나님이 아. So the moment I realized that God loves me more than anyone else, um, the spirit of jealousy just left me. 어전그 감정을 이렇게 바뀌었습니다. 아 하나님께서 나보다 더 여러분들을 사랑해 주셨으면 좋겠다. And then I started to think, uh, I want my God to love others as much as He does. 저보다 더요. Uh, even more than He loves me, I want God to love others. 그리고 저보다 제가 이해할 수 있는 것보다 더. And more than I can ever understand. 그렇게 제 마음이 바뀌게 됐습니다. And God changed my mind. 지금 어, 뭐든지 할수 있을 것 같은데. <웃음> <웃음> 어, 그래서, 어, 그래서 하나님께서 예수님 그 사랑을 어, 사람들에게 강건하신 것과 같이 저도 여러분들께 어, 하나님께서 여러분들을 사랑해 주시기를 간절히 소망합니다. And as Jesus um, wanted everyone to love each other, I hope that God will pour out His love for us all to be here. 감사합니다. Thank you. My name is Ji Hye Yoon. Everyone can hear me? Yes. Yeah. The back. Who can I sit there? 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 We didn't spread out um, glow tracks or um, tissues or anything or letters. We I didn't. Yeah, I didn't. 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 그것을 받는 사람들의 반응을 보게 됐습니다. And as I was taking pictures, I was able to witness other people's um, actions or faces um, while they were sharing the Bible. 제가 찍어야 되는 장면은 청년이 어, 이렇게 전달하는 것과 상대방이 받는 거였어요. And I I had to capture a scene where um, one of us gives uh, something out and the person receives it. 근데 물론 이거를 나눠 주는 본인은 더 그랬지만 제가 그것을 이렇게 캡처하는 사람으로서는 상대방이 그 편지나 물티슈나 그어택을 안 받고 그냥 지나치는 게 되게 마음이 아팠어. And as much as it must have felt um, rejected and um, disappointing um, for the person who was give, trying to giving it out, um, as a person who was taking a picture, um, it was really sad and disappointing to see someone reject. And um, when I saw the person rejecting um, the tracks, I saw myself in that person. And it reminded me of all the moments when I rejected God. Um, every time He tried to help me, approach me, come to me, um, and I said no to Him. 
And I know that God will continuously seek me and try to reach me, but I decided to reach out to Him as well. And I also thought about um, how when even strangers reject us, we get hurt. But how much more hurt God must um, be when we reject Him, um, His children. So I wanted to um, be able to love God more and also love other my neighbors more. Thank you. Okay.